Welcome to Tewkesbury, a medieval town in North Gloucestershire famous for the part it played in the Wars of the Roses. Away from the bustling streets is peace and tranquillity, with ahead of us the Abbey Mill, now standing empty but in recent years open as a venue for recreational use. Tewkesbury must be one of the few towns that has not succumbed to modern and some say ugly architecture. It still retains many fine old black and white buildings, sitting well alongside red brick buildings of a more modern age. There are many interesting small independent shops to explore, including well kept charity shops. The alleys of Tewkesbury originate from the Middle Ages, many of them still with a public right of way. Eagle's Alley is named after 19th century butcher George Eagle. Once a number of cottages were here, known for their poor sanitation with social problems from residents. Not surprising when you learn that there was no water supply in this alley. We cross the road and into Key Street, which is something of a shock with these dilapidated buildings around us. This is the former Healings Mill, when in 1892 was considered to be the largest and most advanced flour mill in the UK. The mill was sold in the 1970s to Allied Mills, who later in 2005 sold it to ADM Milling. They closed it a year later in 2006 and since then the buildings have been allowed to fall into disrepair. We wander a little way along back of Avon to partly cross the footbridge which crosses the River Avon onto the Ham. Turning back we wander into the hustle and bustle of High Street to continue our walk around you.
Arriving at Tewkesbury Abbey, we have little time in which to explore this impressive building. Wirt began building it in 1102 and was consecrated in 1121. There is much to explore and see here, well worth a visit another time.